My name is Brendan Stewart, and I'm a sprinter at the University of Southern California. For six years, track has been a huge part of my life. I've accomplished so much in my collegiate career. I am a national champion, a five-time first-team All-American. It's Southern Cal right now with Johnny Blockberger. And who here comes Joseph Favale, he doesn't catch him. It's USC winning it. And I was ranked top 50 in the 100 meters in the United States. From early mornings at the hill to late nights at a track meet, I wouldn't change the experience for anything. I've given my blood, sweat, and tears to the sport because I love it. I'm glad he did it. I might cry. I love it so much that I realized my identity revolved around the track. Sometimes as collegiate athletes, we get caught up in our studies and the sport. What many don't realize is we are capable of much more than just our athletic ability. There's more to life than track and field, and realizing that allowed me to tap into my creative side off the track. Once we got sent home for the pandemic, I couldn't practice, couldn't run track, so one day I was at Michael's, I bought a lot of canvases, I bought a lot of paint, I was just like, let's see what I can do. But then I found a love for abstract painting because you can really go in any direction, and as long as you understand the painting and you can explain it to other people, that's all that matters. My favorite piece would have to be the one I created for USC during Black History Month because I had the USC colors in the back and then I had the SC, but the SC was different shades of brown and black and I felt like that represented me the most, so that was my favorite piece. Important for all athletes because eventually athletics ends, so you just have to find yourself outside of the sport. What I use painting for is definitely to release all that anxiety, just let the creativity flow. It's important to see other people outside of their sport, see what they do, how they have fun, how they cope with mental health, stress, all these things. And honestly, like life is short, so you just gotta live it to the fullest.